I'm here with Dr. Beth Bryden, Professor of Dermatology, and we're going to be looking at the aging process and some of the solutions for this. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Now we're just going to firstly have a look at um, an animation here we've got of the aging process. So what makes us age? Anywhere between 70-90% of aging is actually due to accumulation of sun exposure and ultraviolet damage that we have through our lifetime. Only 10% is due to the natural intrinsic aging. So in this um, depiction here, you can see the, the blue ultraviolet rays damaging the epidermis where they cause pigmentation to form. We get a tan and age spots. It actually penetrates deeper into the dermis where it can damage the collagen and the elastic fibers. So we get an overall thinning of the epidermis and the dermal layers, causing our skin to atrophy, showing up as wrinkles, age spots, and that sallowness. Which we all don't like, the, the wrinkles. So you're going to tell us a solution to this. So what's a good treatment? One of the best ways you can do is to use sunscreens to prevent ultraviolet. But chemical peels are one of the most effective ways as reversing some of the early signs of aging, such as the fine lines and wrinkles, the pigmentation, evening out the skin tone, and actually improving our skin barrier to protect from additional ultraviolet. And this is um, a patient that's had photo damage, is that correct? And they've had a series of, of skin peels? Correct. You can see here the fine lines and wrinkles on the before and after several skin peels. You can see that the fine lines and wrinkles are diminished, the pigmentation is lighter, and the overall skin tone and glow is much healthier. Great. And then I've got um, one other case study here, which is uh, teenage acne. Oh, the peels are great for teenage acne and even acne rosacea patients. Here you can see the post-inflammatory pigmentation and the active acne papules. And here after a series of peels, it helps promote um, clearing of the acne and it diminishes the post-inflammatory pigmentation. You, you can really see a, a massive difference. And, and these are using like the Neostrata products that have got, what, what is the main active ingredient? Okay, in and the Neostrata products, it's a, a glycolic acid and it's a, the most... Um, consistent free acid so it's the most bioavailable peel that there is available. Great, thank you so much for that. The case studies are absolutely amazing and if you want to find out any more information about skin peels, the aging process, then go on to myfacemybody.com.